What's good, pirates? We've got a lot of news for you. Aboard the ship, ready to go, this is our crew. We've got the scoop, and we'll deliver it to you. The latest news, here's what's good. Howdy, I'm Rob. And aloha, I'm Karen. Today is Wednesday, October 18th, and for lunch we're going to be having chicken pot pie, fresh salad, nachos, and pizza. And in the pizza line, there's going to be Asian tacos, combining Asia and tacos. Two lovely, wonderful things. In one. So go make sure you eat some. And today is the baseball hat fitting and shutting down the field. That is today at 245 at the varsity baseball field. Make sure that you are there if you like baseball. Uh, this month's RB Student Athlete of the Month is Macy Finch for her great work on the slow pitch softball team. She has a batting average of 473 and a GPA of 3.85, and she's a great leader. Good job, Macy. Well deserved. That is very impressive. And t also, the Rogers Athletics Fundraiser is going on right now. You gotta see a fall athlete or Mr. Raycheck for more information on what they're selling and how to get some of it. Ooh, I, could do I need some new sweatpants. And also, Link Crew Leaders, Pirate Court Day has begun today. So if you haven't already, you need to go see if you're leading someone at any time in these next two weeks. This week is Gary and next week is Shaw. The list is outside room N156, which is Bowerman's room. So go and see what's going on. Speaking of leadership, the Native American Youth and Leadership Education Conference is going to be happening uh, at Eastern Washington U University, my alma mater, uh, on November 3rd to November 5th. If you're interested, see Mr. Roos in one, room 104D. Uh, this Friday, October 20th, DECA will be collecting donations at the Homecoming Con for the Vanessa Bayhan Crisis Center for Women and Children. Uh, they'll be doing a Miracle Minute to get as much money as they can in one minute. So help us help those in need. And also, John R. Rogers students and staff, Guess what? Guess what, bro? What? What's going on? I need some... Ooh, what? I need news! Virus Perk is fully operational! Oh, I love coffee. Do they, they have wanna, coffee? They have tons of coffee. They have hot or iced lattes and mochas. And guess what? The special this month is a 12-ounce pumpkin spice latte for only $2.25. Wow, that's a steal. They want to thank you for your patience, and they're looking forward to serving you. My daughter, she loves those pumpkin spice things, and she also wants to be the Lilac Princess. And if you want to be Roger's Lilac candidate for the 2017 to 2018 school year, uh, you have to be a senior girl, have a 3.0 cumulative GPA. And if you want to represent Roger's, there's going to be an informational meeting held this Thursday at 2.40 in the library. Uh, if you can't make the meeting, that's okay. See Mrs. Schumacher in the library any day before school for more details. Also, this Friday, October 20th, is picture retake days during both lunches in the upper gym. Uh, picture forms can be picked up in the offices. And finally, before we take our break, the Bullying Club and SWAT, there are two new clubs that are coming to Rogers and being one. The meetings are Wednesdays in room R217. There's going to be food, games, posters, and you can help improve Rogers and Spokane community. If you have any questions, see Kyle Payton or Jackie Smith. That sounds amazing. Now let's go over to those kooky guys over at sports. What's up guys, welcome back to What's Good Sports, I'm Nick. And I'm Mattel. And Mattel, what do you have going on for us today? Today, right after school, starting at 3 p.m., we got a freshman football game going up against Shadle, and that's at home. So go support our freshman football team. Yeah, Woo! yeah. And then, also today we have a cross-country meet that's at Franklin Park. Wish them good luck, that's at 3.30. And then also, we have a JV softball game versus U High. It's a doubleheader, and you know what doubleheaders mean, that's double the winning. Also, t later today, we have a varsity soccer game against LC. That's at Hartfield, and that starts later at 4 o'clock. So be there. Support our soccer team. And finally, tomorrow night, we have our volleyball team taking on the Shadle Highlanders right here at home. And our varsity starts at 7 o'clock. you got to be there. And this has been What's Good Sports. Back to the news. All right, back from those wild guys over at sports. Uh, if you're 16 years old and want to save a life, the blood drive is happening this Tuesday, October 24th, 
Uh, if you're at all interested, be sure to grab a blood drive permission slip outside of room N156. Be sure to get your form in sooner rather than later, so you know you don't end up donating blood before a big math test or something. And as many of you know, homecoming is this Saturday. And I know some people have a dress, some people don't. Yeah. I don't because I only have these tacky clothes bought by somebody. And so if you need a dress, you have to go to the room R125 or R129 before or after school and just get beautiful dresses. I think that's kind of funny because, you know, you said you like the clothes. Uh, homecoming dance tickets are on sale at the ASB store before school and at both lunches. Tickets are going to be $15 for singles and $25 for couples, so better to go with someone else. Uh, you have to have a Rogers ID to get one, and if you're buying a couple's ticket, you guys both have to have a Rogers ID. Or if your couple is a get, or if your uh, partner, I'm sorry, is a guest from another school, then you got to make sure to have the guest pass form completed. Uh, you can get one of those uh, from the student office, the ASB store, or outside of room N154. And this week, it's the homecoming dress-up days. Thursday's college gear day, Friday's wear your purple and gold, and I don't know, I don't know what Wednesday is. Uh, they just probably left that out or something, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, today was just like a normal day, I yeah, guess. Yeah, I don't know, just normal clothes, normal people. And seniors, you got to submit your senior photo by November 30th. you got to go to the school's webpage and click on the yearbook link and seniors' photos for further details. And that's the way the news goes. to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.